to all Patreons and uh, channel members for uh, supporting me. Uh, I'll be releasing project files to my Patreons and uh, exclusive tutorials for uh, channel members. For details, please check link in description. Thank you. Hello everyone. Uh, welcome back to my channel. This is Mr. Travis. So let's continue with the chase uh, player uh, function. So open your BP drone base. So we have uh, uh, put a couple of branches here. So so this branch will get executed uh, when the attack distance is uh, uh, when the distance of the player between and the drone is more than the attack distance. So it it moves towards the player, and if it is uh, 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 in a negative, then uh, uh, it will move the backwards uh, but if if it is at the right uh, place it has to strafe to the left and right to to avoid uh, being fired by the player so to do that add movement input and uh, in the world direction get the location find Look at rotation. Get right. Get the right vector and connect it to the world direction. So the drone will be moving towards its left and right, and here to the target set the player location. And on the scale value, uh, select float and uh, promote this to a variable. So this will be chase straight right and put this as minus 0.5 and uh, 0.5. So we have to set this uh, chase uh, strafe. So go to event graph and uh, create the custom event chase strafe. Do a flip flop. So every two seconds this will change the direction and uh, add this to uh, begin play. Now let's see. Okay. So this moves to uh, left and right to avoid uh, damage by the player. Okay. In next video, we will uh, set up firing uh, so that the the drone will be attacking the player. Thanks for watching. Bye.